Sticker shock, historic inflation causing a rise in prices nearly everywhere you look, but also some encouraging news on the horizon. ABC's Elizabeth Schulze is in Washington with more. Elizabeth, good morning. Wit, good morning. Well, we are seeing inflation across the economy from food to housing to here at the gas pump. Consumer prices rose by 6.8% in November from a year ago. That's the fastest increase in nearly four decades. These price spikes have been driven by strong demand from consumers, and many parts of the supply chain just have not been able to keep up. The good news is that there is some relief on the way, at least when it comes to gas prices. AAA reports the national average for a gallon of gas is now $3.33. That's still more than a dollar higher than at this time last year, but it has come down eight cents in the last month and has been declining now for two straight weeks. The key driver has been a drop in the price of oil. We've seen oil prices come down as some investors fear global demand could slow down because of the Omicron variant. And at the same time, major oil producing countries have agreed to boost production to boost supply. So far, gas is below $3 in just seven states in California. They are still paying five bucks is still normal in some places. Analysts tell me you can expect gas prices to continue to drop in the next few weeks. That's good news for holiday travelers, but still a long way to go to get the relief from these higher prices. Wit. Elizabeth Schulze, thank you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.